Rag pickers keep neighborhood clean, people avoid them, police harass them, they do it for living to support their families. But the dignity of labor is lost as society looks down upon them. Here's a story of a rag picker, Suman More, who has taken her work to a global platform and experts today wait to hear from her experience. Suman More is a 45-year-old rag picker from Pune. She has spent her entire life picking up waste. Suman More could not have imagined in her wildest dreams that one day she could be the center of attention for about 2,000 experts. Gathered from all over the world at a conference held all the way in Geneva by the International Labour Organization and she would tell them her story. Uh, next, uh, we realized that we, we used to fight our problems on our own for the longest time, but we realized that we could not do it by ourselves. So one by one, we started coming together one at a time, and slowly this group grew, and we could see that by organizing and by fighting against these odds together, we had a better chance of overcoming our problems. So we started with 80 women, and then adding one, 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 we went from 80 to 100 to 500. And now after 20 years, we have 8 to 10,000 waste pickers just in the city of you wouldn't see this kind of a reception for an informal waste picker in our country. Uh, when she would walk into the room, people would look up at her. They would be curious who she is. They would come up to her and ask her. And they would ask me or somebody else to translate for them. Suman More's life has been a rags to recognition story. Suman came to Pune in search of a job when drought hit her village, Kalam. Life wasn't easy. After many initial unsuccessful bids, she eventually began picking up waste like iron rods and other scrap material for a living. A day spent in collecting scrap would earn her a meager sum of 30 to 40 rupees. It was difficult to maintain a family of six with this paltry earning. Her profession was looked down upon and daily harassment from public and law keepers would make her life miserable. But Suman can't be defeated. She managed to put all her kids through school. Today, she uses the money she now earns through rack picking to support the education of underprivileged children. Suman has united rack pickers of the city to form their own organization. With Pankaj Khelkar in Pune, Bureau Report, India Today.